I'm going to make my way back to Earth. You can stay here and suffer the same fate as this planet. I... thank you. P please have mercy. Please have mercy. I beg you. How can you beg for mercy? How many people begged you for mercy before you slaughtered them? How many? I beg you. I've given you just a little bit of my energy. That's all you get. You're on your own. Is why you you must you must die by my hand. You fool! What? The mortal enemies known as Frieza and Goku had once fought to the death on the planet Namek. During their epic showdown, Goku's anger triggered something. It awakened the Super Saiyan transformation, which helped him defeat the terrible tyrant Frieza. With Goku having defeated Frieza, it was believed the two fighters would never again cross one another's paths. But that was not the case. Having been brought back to life with the use of Earth's Dragon Balls, Frieza lived once again. He now sought vengeance against the Saiyan who'd humiliated him. Determined to exact his revenge, Frieza gathered his forces, also brought back in preparation for the battle. Mere moments before the... <laughs> the time for vengeance has finally arrived. Now then, let's pay Goku's beloved Earth a visit, shall we? Goku and Vegeta continue their own intense training under the watchful eyes of Whis on Beerus's planet. The two warriors are... <sighs> I believe that will do for today. I must say, you two have made considerable progress with respect to movement, but your speed still needs work. Still needs work? You're still relying far too much on your head. This habit is especially strong with you, Vegeta. <laughs> you really do like to overthink everything, Vegeta. Shut up! You're only thinking less because you're an idiot! Perhaps you've noticed, but you always manage to be one step behind Goku. Do you know why that is? You're far too tense, making it more difficult for you to fight at your full potential. You need to relax more, like Goku. You just had to bring that up, didn't you? Goku, you on the other hand are overconfident. Let your focus waver and you're doomed to fail. What? We'll work on conquering these shortcomings of yours as we continue. All right. Just gotta focus. Focus, focus, focus. Well, I think that's enough rest for now, wouldn't you agree? Shall we continue your training? Yeah. As the two of you have unique needs in your training, what do you say we do this one at a time? You got it. You know, I actually prefer doing it this way. <laughs> you won't get any complaints from me. Oh my, you two really don't get along, do you? I can't imagine why that is. Now then, let's start things off with you, Goku. Woohoo! Too bad for you, Vegeta! <laughs> Makes no difference. Go ahead! 
This I should be. <laughs> <laughs> Marvelous. This is the regimen I've prepared for you. Now then, let's have you break through the walls a little. Try to imagine yourself capable of more than you are now. Here goes, please! Unless you truly fight with the intention to defeat me. Yeah. My turn now! What you good? Let's end things here for now. Wonderfully handled, Goku. You know, I don't really feel like I've gotten that much stronger. I bet Lord. Indeed, you're far from ready to best him. However. If you were to push the godly power you've attained even further, you could increase your odds. Seriously? You're gonna teach me how I can do that, right, Whis? I am indeed. I really admire your positive attitude. Perhaps that is the true source of your power. <laughs> Once you're ready, willing, and able to resume your training, please do come find me immediately. Okay, will do, Whis. <laughs> Are you ready to begin your training? Don't become overconfident and don't give your opponent an opening. Failure to bolster one's defense to reach the disaster. Be aware of your surroundings. on my own. Thanks, Whis. On to the next task. Now we need to ensure that we can bring Vegeta up to your level. After all, it's absolutely paramount that both of you increase your strength and power right now. Right. Couldn't agree more. And I think Vegeta's gonna be just fine. He'll probably master this new power in no time. He's just that good, you know? <laughs> It's I'm right. smart mom. No. After Weiss's training, I'll be number one. Now then, let's have you break through the walls limiting you. Try to imagine yourself capable of far more than you are now. Your training won't end unless you truly fight with the intention of Going on! Your movements are clean, and you appear to be clean. Struggling. Well done, Vegeta. Color me impressed. You call yourself a genius, and I dare say it's not mere hubris. <laughs> I still haven't reached yours or Lord Beerus's level. I won't be satisfied until I do. You always have your nerves wound up in a bunch. This tension will prevent you from acting when you need to most. Find a way to conquer this shortcoming, and you'll no doubt push your godly power even further than you thought possible. <laughs> Once you're ready to resume your training, Fine. Got it. Are you ready to begin your training? Your task will be to rely less on your mind than more on your body. Not to be so tense. Relax and try to remain calm. Thinking of an action first and then performing is too slow. Best to remember that. Feel your body and its needs. Allow them to guide you. I can't tell if I'm actually getting stronger if I'm just wasting my time. There's no need for.
for you to worry, Vegeta. You are getting stronger. Interesting. Let's see if we can maintain this until the very end. I'm impressed with your performance. My goal is clearer than ever. All that remains. Goku and in the end, the two Saiyans had met. You're both here. Yep, let's get right into it. The time has come. takes a lot out of you, even more than Super Saiyan God. It's probably because we've become Super Saiyans while well, still, this power is incredible. Hmm. Look at that. Your efforts have finally paid off. <laughs> Though, it looks like we can't stay in this form for very long. Which means we haven't completely mastered it yet. You two have really surprised me. I must have... You know... I'm pretty surprised, too, if I'm honest. I had no idea I could go beyond Super Saiyan God. <laughs> You're not the only one who pulled it off. Seems your days at the top might be numbered. Indeed. You two have both managed to become Super Saiyans with the power of Super Saiyan Gods. Hmm. That's a rather cumbersome way of putting it. Let's see. Your hair becomes blue while in this form, so perhaps Super Saiyan Blue would be more suitable. Super Saiyan Blue? Now that you've achieved this power, I think all that remains is to put said power to the test. I want you to engage me in battle using all of your power. Up for it? This should help you come to terms with your new form. All right, let's do this! Magnificent! Out of my way, Kakarot! <laughs> You're in my way, too. Now, now, you two! This is certainly not the time to squabble. That's it! You're adapting better than I expected. This is great! I think it's getting the hang of it. We are just getting started! are phenomenal. It seems the Super Saiyan Blue form is becoming second nature to the pair of you. Should the two of you learn to work together, I dare say you could possibly go toe-to-toe -to -toe with even the likes of Lord Beerus. Whoa, really? Well, to tell you the truth, I'd much rather fight him by myself. <laughs> I'm the one taking Lord Beerus down, and I'll do it without your help. Oh, Father, this intense rivalry between you two is proving most troublesome. So, Whis, could you... <laughs> it would be my pleasure. What? I'm not going to let you hog all of Whis's time! I'm... Uh... Meanwhile, on Earth, Gohan's calm, carefree life was interrupted when he was summoned by Piccolo to engage in some grueling training. <sighs> All right, take a breather. Whew. I haven't done anything this... You're a lot sloppier than before. 
Seems like these peaceful times have made you soft. Yeah, sorry about that. It's just, my mom keeps giving me a hard time about my studies. <laughs> I don't care about your studies. You can't neglect your training. That's the one thing. Uh, yeah, you're right. I'll try to work some into my schedule when I can. We're getting right back into it after this break, and it won't be nearly as easy as... Huh? 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 What was that? S some sinister energy is making its way here. It, it can't be him, can it? Yeah, I know this energy all too well. It's definitely him. The large source of energy, Gohan... That's right. Frieza had finally made his arrival to the planet Earth. I've waited far too long for this moment. That said, it seems I have a little time to kill before Goku makes his arrival. Perhaps I should have some fun while I wait. <laughs> Unbeknownst to Gohan and Piccolo, they were Krillin, Tien, and the others, sensing the sudden appearance of an- A lot of energy levels are cropping up all- Yeah, we better hurry after them. Yeah, there's a lot Got of- Got it. Let's go. They're more powerful than we originally right. yeah. And so, the fight with the Frieza Force had officially begun. They're moving all over the place. Time to put a stop to this. All these goons are packing some serious power. If we don't reduce their numbers, they could overwhelm us. Let's go! Oh! 
That'll do. Breathe. I recognize these energy sources. All right, better hurry. What's Lisa doing here on Earth? Let's do this! Since before, belong to the Ginyu Force after all.
be over real quick. and his team arrived at the source of the very powerful energy force. That's Frieza's spaceship. I'm guessing that... Seems like you also had to deal with Frieza's men. Yeah. Sensing some seriously strong energy from that ship. <laughs> Once again, you have done remarkably well in besting Ginyu and his men, since it's difficult to find good minions in this universe. I must commend you on a job well done. And what's more is that you've come to greet me. I'm fairly impressed. Freezer! 
Well, if it isn't the Namekian who attempted to fight me. Oh. Now, where might Goku be? My dad's off somewhere far away training. He's not here. How unfortunate. I was hoping to kill him and blast this backwater planet. What the? Oh, 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 oh. Is it not painfully obvious? Must I spell it out for you? Revenge. Nothing more, nothing less. Goku must suffer for what he's done to me. I had a feeling it was something like that. The utter humiliation that Saiyan caused me. I will not allow his actions to go unpunished. Unfortunately, he doesn't seem to be here. No matter. Knowing him as well as I do, he'll eventually show his face. However, I am not a patient man. I don't intend to just sit here and wait for him. Perhaps I'll warm up by torturing you first. <clears throat> this, this power he's hiding... Free... Okay, I think that's a good stopping point. This Super Saiyan Blue Trans... I intend to perfect this fool. There's no way I'm letting that happen. <laughs> oh, it seems I have a call from Earth. Please. Why, hello? Did he say Boma? I see. I'll be sure to pass your message on to... Something happened on... Well... What? Freeze is alive! Huh? Why in the world would Frieza choose to do this? Beats me. I haven't. If I had to venture a guess, I'd say he's there to get revenge on you, Goku. Ah, Lord Beerus! Did you enjoy your nap? It was fine, but I would have slept even better if I hadn't gone to bed on an empty stomach. Even if he is seeking some sort of revenge, Trunks and Goten should be more than enough to put someone of Frieza's power level in their place. Oh, I'm afraid that doesn't appear to be the case. 